close your eyes and imagine that you are lying in your bed and snuggling under your covers. You feel warm and drowsy. Stretch your arms and legs as you take a deep breath. Breathe in and then slowly let the air flow out again. Just let yourself be quiet and listen to what I describe. You look out the window by your bed and you see the blue sky through the trees that shade your window. White wisps of clouds float lazily across the blue background. You feel warm rays of the sun shining down on your head. The muscles in your face are relaxing in the warmth. Your face and neck and shoulders feel so relaxed and comfortable. You feel the warm relaxation flowing down your body all the way to your feet. You feel so comfortable and relaxed, so safe and secure in your bed. As the sun shines into your room, you see the outline of a door on your wall. You've never seen this secret door before because it is only visible when the sun shines in just the right way on the wall. You get out of your bed and push on the door. It opens and you see a flight of stairs. You walk down the stairs and find yourself on the edge of a forest. You see a path curving through the forest and a sign by the path that says, Magical Forest. As you walk towards the sign, you see a tiger coming out of the forest. The tiger says to you, Do you want to visit the mother eagle's nest and see her little ones? You answer that you do. The tiger squats low to the ground and tells you to climb on his back. Now hold on tight to my fur. You put your arms around the tiger's neck and snuggle into his fur. He is so soft and warm. He begins to run down the path through the forest and you feel the air blowing through your hair. You can smell the fresh pine of the trees and you hear the birds chirping in the branches. You see the rays of the sun sparkling through the leaves of the trees and dancing all around you. It almost looks like little fairies flitting through the forest. Soon you hear the sound of running water and you see that the path is along a bubbling brook. You hear the water running over the rocks, sounding like music to accompany the dance of the fairies. As the tiger continues along the path, you see that the brook leads to a lake ahead of you. You see the deep blue of the water reflecting the blue sky and wispy clouds and sparkling in the sun. 
The tiger comes to the edge of the lake and says, The mother eagle lives on the other side of the lake. I can't take you any farther because I can't swim. But we can call the great fish in the lake to take you across. The tiger walks to the edge of the lake and calls out, Great fish, we have a friend who wants to visit Mother Eagle and see her little ones. Soon you see a large wake moving through the lake, coming towards you. Then suddenly a large fish jumps up into the air, its silvery scales glittering in the sunlight. Then the fish swims into the shallow water by the shore. The tiger tells you to hold on to the great fish's fin, and it will take you across the lake. You walk into the lake and grab a hold of the fin. The great fish begins to swim across the lake, pulling you along. All around you, smaller fish are swimming along and jumping into the air playfully. Soon you come to the other side of the lake. You thank the great fish for the ride and walk on to the shore of the lake. As you do, a gentle breeze blows and you feel all your clothes magically drying. A large grassy meadow spreads out in front of you. You see flowers of red and blue and yellow and orange swaying in the gentle breeze. Butterflies of all colors are flitting from one flower to another. You take a deep breath and smell the fragrance of the flowers. You walk across the meadow and come to the edge of the forest bordering the meadow. The largest tree you've ever seen spreads out in front of the forest, rising high into the sky. As you get near the tree, you notice that one of the branches close to the ground bends lower, inviting you to step onto it. As you step onto the branch, it gently begins to rise until you can easily step on to the next branch. You continue to climb the tree with ease, noticing that smaller branches reach around you, protecting you from falling. You feel very safe and secure as you climb into the highest branches of the tree. Soon you notice a large bird's nest the largest you have ever seen. The nest is nestled in the branches and is big enough for you to climb into. You look over the edge of the nest and see the baby birds sleeping peacefully. As you climb into the nest, they begin chirping and snuggling up next to you. Your trip has made you very sleepy and you lay down with the baby birds and begin to drift, drift off to sleep. Before you fall asleep though, you notice a large shadow darkening the sky above you. As you watch, you see a large, beautiful, bald eagle circling closer and closer until it lands on the edge of the nest. She says to you, I am Mother Eagle. I see that you have made friends with my little ones. As you watch, she feeds the baby birds. Then she asks, Would you like to go for a ride on my back? I can fly you back home across the lake. And you say, oh yes, I would like that very much. 
The mother eagle then tells you to climb onto her back and to hold tight to her feathers. She asks, Are you ready? And you say excitedly, Yes. You hear the baby birds start to chirp as she spreads her wings and begins to slowly rise into the sky. You see the baby birds in the great tree get smaller and smaller as you soar high above the trees. You can see the forest below you and the meadow full of flowers and the lake. As you look at the lake, you see the great fish jump high out of the water, waving its tail. As you fly, you can feel the wind against your skin. You feel so light and free. It feels so wonderful to be flying on the back of the ego. As you continue to look down, you soon see your house come into view. The eagle soars in great circles above the forest and the lake. She glides on the wind and just floats through the air as you look down at the forest. Soon she begins to descend in great circles, this way and that towards your house. She lands on the ledge of your window and you climb through and snuggle back into bed as she tells you goodbye. You feel yourself getting very drowsy and drifting off to sleep as you remember your adventure through the magical forest. You dream about the tiger, the great fish, the baby birds, and flying on the back of Mother Eagle. You sleep a very restful and refreshing sleep until you gently wake up in the morning.